Hi guys, welcome to Red Dog Gaming, where today we are bringing you another video of Teutonic Order into Prussia. Now in this video, we'll bring you a war, we'll be building the nation, we'll be gaining a lot of claims on everywhere, and we'll be getting an amazing new leader, so stay tuned for that. Make sure you like, follow, and subscribe, and follow me on Twitch, link in the description below. Thank you very much guys, and enjoy. Loads of, loads of permanent claims. It needs to be, what does it need to be? Just make sure, 125, okay. Need to be ready to press it the moment I send the gift. Got another cardinal, fine. Oh, they want more now. Do we, nah, is it still, would you pay, that is the question, would you pay 325 gold? For a permanent claim on all of that and i i think i i would so i'm gonna do it i mean if yeah we'll still have the minus 25 allied to rival oh there we are and then we get permanent claims over all of this worth it probably Hopefully, <laughs> I'm not sure. I, I, I mean, it's got to be worth it, isn't it? Permanent claims on all of that. So these claims, I think, are mine that I've made. But all these, permanent, pretty good, pretty strong. Now Bohemia should maybe hate me. Border friction is only minus one. Yeah. Brandenburg's no longer a valid rival. Do we just stab Bohemia in the back? Oh, Poland. We'll get rid of you now. When's our truce up with Poland? 1473. Who are your allies? I think we use Bohemia one more time. Lithuania and Denmark. I think we use Bohemia for the foreseeable future until we can get an alliance with Austria. We can't join the HRE because it needs to be 184 for some reason. If we get too big though, we just won't be allowed in. It's a bit, but we still will have that minus 25 allied to Ottomans. So, so if that allied to Bohemia goes, that's we're at 83. I mean, army strength for me. We've got 20. It's not that bad. Minus 30 for that army strength. Yeah, it's going to be pretty hard to get an alliance with them. So I don't think we're going to be. Don't think we're going to be put into the HRE, so we're going to have to destroy it. Bohemia get Bohemia's voting for themselves. Yeah, cool. Uh, what do we want to do with our diplomats? Three claims on Lithuania. We've got all these, so we don't really need. Do we start? I think we claim on Denmark. Then Bohemia. You're still happy. Brunswick. Hmm. Did you? How did? Maybe they got cancelled in a war. I didn't notice that. Must have got cancelled in a war. We kind of... We want a... We want a little vassal. How do your allies feel about helping you? Oh. I mean, Ottomans, Muscovy and me could definitely handle all of them. It'd just be, we don't have manpower. Not in a position. Um, Pomerania is looking strong. I mean, Austria would join. No, we're screwed if we do that. I think we wait for Poland. And if, oh yeah, I forgot. I mean, Ottomans will join. I mean, we're not going to do it now, obviously, for the truce. Bohemia. Plus 13. Need to get Bohemia into another war, really. Is that, is that connected to my lands? Because I could declare war on them. Oh, oh, no thanks. 
The problem is with the small nations in this game is they all get a few troops. Like it's not not a lot of troops individually, but if you go up against five or six, suddenly it's a 25 stack or a 20 stack. And you're like, how did this happen? But they all have a few little troops. Um, I think we want to get a claim here because if we take this, we can release plots. Can we release plots from here? No. Livonia and Livonian order. Plotsk has like five cores, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, six, six cores. Pretty good for reconquesting, so we'll get another claim there. Now we just want to get our institution done. Do these, yeah. Is that already? Yeah, it is. Brilliant. Uh, what do we want to do? Do we want to drill? I think... No, we want to build up our money reserves a bit more once again. Just in case. We want to be able... I mean, we need to pay for the institution. Um, yeah, take it all the way to the back with, with full army. There will be blood. Has uh, Maine happened yet? Oh, I was going to say, is that England? That, that's amazing if it is. Never see them smash someone so much. But no, it's Burgundy. Oh, just peaced out. Get a one, level one Inquisitor, 10 Papal Influence. My Theologian dies, I don't want that. Can we do anything with this Papal Influence? What, before we lose 20? Yeah. Yeah, there we are. Oh, we just got to our... So where do we have... No more places. Present. I think maybe this one. Just do that for the time being. Until we can afford to embrace it. 289 now. Oh, see, this is uh, pretty sure this is an event from uh, three stability. I'm not sure. Could be. Could be from our advisors, but I think it is. Oh, that can one two eighteen. So we need to spend a bit of that as well. How about a general? Twenty two. Oh. 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 oh, thank you. Arnold, the saviour. Love my deck. Nought, nought, three, nought. Brilliant. Best general. Quality. <laughs> thank you to everyone who's uh, followed today. That's brilliant. Um, as I say, we will be playing tomorrow again. Um, I'm pretty sure it'll be this, but uh, we'll have a think about it by the end of the uh, end of the uh, live stream. Do you want money? Fifty percent cheaper level two philosopher. Hmm. Is a philosopher Diplo? Or is he? Let's just take the money because we want to build up to getting this, don't we? we build a marketplace, apparently. Ooh, nine. How are we looking on trade anyway? 36% of the... Are we these mothballed or not? I thought they were mothballed. Uh, no, they're mothballed. We don't need them right now. We, we only need them against Denmark, but Denmark probably outclasses to start with, really. And is there anything we want to do with our admin power that's not development? I mean, we've got... We've got stability so I think I mean some of these are terrible um, Ostero you've got autonomy so maybe not we'll put one put two in here hopefully we can embrace soon next one will be the colonialism which 
if it's in Spain or... Oh. Right, well, we've just been rejected from that. We'll get a claim on Lund. Um, good. In Sweden, do you want me to support your independence yet? No. Um, can we fabricate claim? No. Muscovy, I, I'm sorry to say, is terrible this game for some reason. So, Novigrad, who are you allied with Denmark? See how close are they to not joining? Very far away. Hmm. Let's have a look. Got all the claims we really want. All the allies are pretty happy. I think we'll just uh, improve relations here. Okay, how close is anyone to becoming a vassal? Uh, it's not here. Yeah, I thought it was there. Uh, here we are. Rigo is at 77. Oh, I forgot about Rigo. Who are you allied to? Hamburg and Lübeck. That is a juicy, juicy province. So is um, Hamburg. Very juicy. We'll get the uh, get the claim going, and then we will on Polokas. Did all your people still protect you? How about? Ooh, not Scotland. But still Poland and Aragon. I just don't want to have to march all the way down to Aragon. It'd be pretty annoying. How are you looking? Ooh, part of a trade league. Yeah. How close would you be to vassalization then? I mean, I think we try. We need it to be 190. If we offer them, if it looks likely, we'll offer them an alliance. And if we, if we can't, we'll just default, dissolve it, attack them in five years' time or so. In terms of missions, we do kind of need that. So expansion in Pomerania, yeah. These are all tough at the minute because of the uh, aggressive expansion, and also uh, Bohemia being in the way. Urban development. Okay, so Konigsberg and Danzig need to have development at least 16 and churches and marketplaces. Yep, we're not in a position to do that yet. Could just go for Novgorod. Yes, we can have a look. I think we want to take this though, because that's really good. Gives us permanent claims here and uh, here. And then when we've taken that, we get local development costs minus 5% for the rest of the game. Pretty good. Oh, my days, eventually. What do we want then? Prestige again, no. Probably war taxes. Could do claims, but it's got to be an aggressive expansion, hasn't it? Then we'll go for war taxes, I think, next. Claims bordering claims we don't really need because of all those claims we just bought. <laughs> oh, military development. Your grain, so that's good. I know you've got 16%, but... Um, there we are. What, how much are we on? 283 we need. Getting five a turn, that's pretty good. Truce with Poland's ended. I mean, we need our tech up again to... Uh, to fight Poland. So I think we just kind of sit here for a little bit. So as I said, in terms of the goals, 
we want to be making Prussia, destroying the HRE and potentially, if we can stretch our empire, the whole of the northern region here and northern Germany, be pretty happy. Potentially, if we can get to Paris, that would also be very nice. That's a long way off. Very 287. Get close. Oh, missed out on that again. Whoops. Two hundred forty-one. We might. No, we're gonna have to do that again. Level three. Level. I mean, that ten prestige as well. That's fine. Grain. Give you a couple. Of Anyone. Just keep that going. 24% institution tech penalty now. How high up are all of you guys? 42, 76. Hmm. I think we just take it as soon as we can now. And then we can go to war. See which is the most opportunistic war that we have. Keep the forts on, keep that army tradition going up a little bit. It's not going up, but yeah, we'll take the yearly corruption. Hmm, that's all right, 122, pretty good. Still, if we can level up a rank, that's plus 30, so that's minus 50. Reading government rank, yeah. Economic base. A diplo reps helping. I'm not sure we're going to be able to do it. Hmm. We'll get back to uh, fabricating on Denmark. We'll we'll play it by ear with Riga. I don't really want to fight the whole trade league. Kind of frustrating. Trade League of Novogrod's disbanded. Okay, so is Riga in that one? Or was it just Novogrod? Let's have a look. Okay, just Denmark and Odayev. Denmark comes with Sweden and everything though. Don't know whether we can deal with just me and Muscovy. Okay, no. Also, Get minus one stability, which I don't want. How about you guys? Oh, we could absolutely smash them. Ottomans versus Aragon would be nice. There we got Muscovy. Muscovy would take out Lithuania with me. And then the Ottomans. Yep, yeah, I think that's the war we'll, we'll do when we are... You know, promising the Ottomans territory, but I'm not really bothered if I have to give them some, you know, territory down here. It's not going to snuffle my plans until they come up here and start smashing Poland. Do you want to keep Bohemia high? I think we keep the Ottomans high. Should be able to get our institution done in the next one. So here we are, 300 now. Oh, was it 280 before? I swear, I think. I don't really want the uh, nobility to lose. So what do we want here? Morale of armies, I think. Development cost minus five, no. That missionary strength will be very nice for when we become Protestant, but we already get so many benefits from everything else. If we become defender of the faith. Morale of armies plus 10. Yeah, that's just so strong. Yeah, definitely we need that. Uh, institution 294. Anyone else got it yet? How close are you guys? 67. 90. I think we'll wait for Tuchel to do it. 58. 
we need to do a couple more developments again. Maybe into gel to just get get it to be done. Look, yeah. You're green, so this could be helpful. Yeah, that should get the uh I should get it now. Yep. Probably can afford it now. Yep. Let's do that. Boom. How many techs can we do? Two. Two. And we should be still on track for our military tech, so that's pretty good. Okay. I think we've been going local noble every time, but clergy's loyalty is starting to go down. I mean, it's still the highest, so we're still going to go with it. And we get the extra prestige. Lose devotion, which doesn't really matter. And let's hope they're good. Average has tragically died. Let's see. Ooh. <laughs> no, average has been replaced by awful the second. Awful the second. Um it doesn't change the age of discovery it just gives you more splendor ideas and it gives you more splendor ability to, to generate splendor <laughs> yeah that that poor awful the second i mean we had awful the first and he was i think he might have been exactly oh i think he might have been two zero one rather than two one zero but um yeah here's to a hunting accident definitely but and we can't even disinherit in this. Oh, and look, he's got he's got ship durability. That's what we need. This guy though, Hockmeister, good the first beast. Um, he just needs a bit more military skill. But trade efficiency, good modifying advisor costs is amazing. Um, I think we'll take this national propaganda, aggressive expansion, and the manpower and morale is pretty strong. War taxes is a bad finisher. And the monthly war exhaustion. Pretty good. And then I think we'll take uh, Christian second. Do we want to change off this? I think we might just go neutral. But then, oh yeah, it's a 2 1 0. But it are awful von Erstlingen. I think we'll go neutral. Get the get these two up because we're doing all right for mill at the minute. Too high taxes. Oh, these places don't have. Oh, Revol might have uh, unrest. Oh, it's all right. Say what? We cannot hear you. Poor people being taxed. Pomerania's opinion. I no, don't care about that. Right. Um. So now we're caught up with military tech. Lithuania going to be smashed. Um, gone. Uh, let's have a look. Yeah, I think this is going to work quite well. Let's get our, uh, because the Ottomans should go after Aragon, hopefully. I mean, they might just come march up here, but if, if they do, Aragon's just going to have to march all the way through here to me, which is fine. Um, Muscovy and me will take out Lithuania and Odea. Like, they don't matter. So, time to get a little battle, I think. You got any uh, mothball thoughts? No, not on the book. Oh, if we could get to Muscovy. Oh, they're not going to let us have military access. No. Well, I think we'll go off to um, Kaunas. How have you pronounced that? So here we are, new leader. Yeah, we got a good leader as well, Arnold. Saved us from our terrible 0030. <laughs> oh. Yeah, awful, you can be a leader. If he dies though, oh, not even that bad. I'll 
just put a one and you're hoping that it'll die and army maintenance up we're still making four it's fine we've got about eleven thousand so look get our morale up to full and we will destroy lithuania put the speed down We'll promise the Ottomans some land. We'll just give them, just give them some Aragon territory. We'll probably give them like Malta or something. Something terrible that they don't really want. It's not got much development. Um, Muscovy, Muscovy doesn't want land, and we're not going to give it to them because we're probably going to come into conflict with them soon. I don't want that. Um, take that. I know some... Oh, do you have a siege? Oh my days! Awful! You have two siege pips! How did I not notice this? You are amazing! No, I'm joking. It's alright. Do you have access to cannons yet? No. Yeah. Hmm. So, why I, why I decided to take... Kaunas, Kaunas, or whatever, I don't know how you say it, um, as the war goal, even though it's a fort, it's because if we take it, then we're basically just guaranteed ticking war score. Ottomans, whoa, the supreme Lithuanian army is taking on the Ottomans. Maybe we should take their lead. <laughs> Yeah, I was going to say, if they had maritime ideas, then that'd be pretty funny. Whoa. Skov is strong. 3k versus 6k, and it wins. I kind of want to move these guys closer. I mean, how long did it take to get there? 8th of September. 10 days. Be all right. Muscovy, do you have any claims over here? You have one. That's fine, we won't give it to you. Poland? Wait, if we... Is that true, Scott? Yeah? Cool. Uh, Poland. What the? Aragon. What are you doing? Don't do this to me. Right, we'll take Karunas and then we'll go smash. Awful, you did something good. I still want you to die though. <laughs> oh yeah, we need we need awful to have this little army so he dies. Uh Aragon I think Aragon saw saw the, the troops and left. I don't want to take any direct con conflicts, really. Not while our manpower is just so fragile. Uh, what's the uh, WS, sorry? One, two, three, six. Are you level two? Oh no, you're level three. You guys, I oh know, that's the wrong, Arnold, wait, I'm so confused, Arnold, go away, you guys go, with Awful leading you, Awful is strong at sieges, there's a one thing he knows how to do, he doesn't know, I mean, I don't know how he's good at sieges when he's got zero, <laughs> is that, that, it's actually kind of surprising that he got this many pips when he's got a zero military pip. Oh, well, time for a battle. Yeah, we're smashing them. Oh, are they on a lower tech? Five, we're on six, yeah. We should have cannons soon. Do we have enough money for cannons? Yeah. Do we? How many cannons do we want though? That's the thing. 
Ooh, that's good. State maintenance minus 10%. Honest administrators. Trust your neighbour. Well, I mean, we're smashing two of our neighbours. We're going to go to war with that one. We're going to go to war with that one. We went to war with that one. We're going to betray that one. Very trustworthy. Arnold. Um, you can get a start on there. That's the that's the one we really want. Odeyev. I just want... Uh, some money from you. Oh, is that it? Force religion as well, actually. And become Catholic just for the prestige. It, does it give you pre prestige? Oh. So, 23. Yeah, 42%. How are we looking down here? Ottomans. Oh, Ottomans are all here like a rash. You need to be fighting Aragon. Minus 64, great. 50 Diplo power, thank you very much. So now we want to decide, do we just want to focus on propaganda? And yeah, that Diplo tech doesn't matter at all, does it? Nine per turn, pretty good. If we get a half, are you half price then? But no, you're not up. It's because you're... I think we'll bump that up to 10. We've got enough money. Um, next siege. Oh, we'll, we'll just take some of our claims. Carpet a bit. Oh, actually, we could swap out Awful for uh, Arnold. Time. Oh, cool. Got plenty of time left. Uh, let's have a look. Minus twenty one percent. Ottomans, give that land to me. Oh, wait, we'll swap out. Awful. For uh, Arnold. 